All right, guys, so I'm going to show you how to encrypt the contents of a file. And it could be a picture or a file with text in it. Like I have this file on my desktop here with some passwords in it. I want to encrypt that. Or I have this picture. It's just a snapshot of my desktop. But I want to encrypt those files so that nobody knows what they are. So I'm going to use OpenSSL to do that. I'm going to type in cat. I'm going to drag this file, this passwords file. I'm going to add a pipe because I'm going to pipe that cat, catted information into the OpenSSL command. Type in OpenSSL. I want to use AES192-CBC. You can choose whatever encryption you want. You can take a look at the man page. I'm just using this for the example. I could use any of the variety of encryption methods. Then I'm going to apply a salt to this encryption. And I'm going to use my salt password. And I'm going to output it into an encrypted file. Drag that back in there so it goes into the same place. And I'm going to type ENC and boom. It's going to create an encrypted file. If I hit spacebar, you can't see any of the information. If I delete my original password file, now I just have this. If I type cat and try to see the contents of this, what we're going to see is a bunch of gibberish, right? Because it's salted, right? Um, and it's encrypted. So now let's unencrypt this file. So basically, one sec, clear the screen. All right, so now we want to unencrypt this file. So we're gonna do the same exact, except for the reverse. And I'm gonna cat this file. I'm gonna pipe that into OpenSSL. And I'm gonna use the same encryption, AES192CBC. And then I'm going to use the D option to decrypt. I still have to use the salt because that's my password I used. Minus K. Oh, my salt password, I believe, is the right one. And I need to output that file. And this is RTF is the original. You do want to know the extension type hit enter, go over to this file, hit spacebar, and there is my file contents. So now I've created an encrypted file with, with my passwords in it. I can do the exact same thing with this desktop picture file. So if I just arrow up and uh, I use the option key to in this cell sh shell session, I can drag this desktop picture in there. And we're going to encrypt this. And as you can see, it is right there. Arrow up. Put a minus D in there. Change these around. Hopefully I'm not going too incredibly fast. But if I delete this before I run it, now it's back. And that's really it. That's how easy it is to encrypt the contents of a file and add your own salt uh, password to it to make it even more complex and make it harder to hack right hopefully you like the video and if you ain't subscribed to the channel get subscribed um, and you know uh, this kind of stems into you know doing these different things and if you want to take this to a next uh, level higher uh, find the video that I have hopefully it's up already 
of the um, hiding of files so now that you have this encrypted file maybe you want to hide it so check out that video you guys have an awesome day and take care